Hey guys, it's Katie from Mattress Clarity. Today I'm talking about down pillows. These are my four favorite down pillows. So down is definitely that classic, luxurious feel. Sometimes when people may think, oh, this is out of my budget, it's too fancy. And I'm here to tell you that's definitely not the case. We're gonna go over four pillows that really run the gamut of price, design, different cool features. I'm gonna tell you why I love each of them. We're also gonna give Martin in here. He's gonna give you his take as well. He's a foot taller than me. Definitely has his eye on which pillows are gonna be good for heavier sleepers. And then I'm gonna answer some commonly asked questions about down pillows. So if you're ready to learn a little bit about down and check out my pillow stick around because the review is about to start right now. All right, in all my years at Mattress Clarity, I've had the chance to review a lot of pillows, and I've got all my thoughts and reviews up on mattressclarity.com. So all you gotta do is go to the website, click the Best Pillows tab. You're gonna see a huge list come down. I've got tons of lists, all my favorite pillows lined up in different categories, plus individual and reviews and big comparisons as well. So there's certainly a lot there to check out. Definitely comment below at the end of this video and tell me which of these four pillows do you think is gonna be a good fit for you as someone who likes down pillows. I'm super curious. I wanna add more down pillows to my list of ones to review and I want to know what you guys like. And now I want to share one of my favorite down pillows, which also happens to be one of my favorite Tempur-Pedic pillows. This is the Temper Down Precise Support. So this is definitely a luxurious pillow and it's definitely going to feel like it. So on the outer cover, you get 100% cotton, 500 thread count. So it's got that beautiful like chic hotel, fancy pillow feel to it. Very crisp cotton. And then inside the cover is where this white duck down is. So it's 51% white duck down. It's definitely got that very soft, light, fluffy feel and it's super insulating. What you're going to do is actually unzip the cover, which is where that down is, and you're going to access the core, and the core is temper material. It's shredded chunks of temper material, which is proprietary memory foam. So it's a very interesting mix of both down and foam, but what you're really going to get overall is this very nice, soft, luxurious, classic down pillow feel that's not going to fall flat on you because that core is going to prevent that from happening. It's going to enhance it by giving it an extra level of support. So I am totally here for this design. I think it's so smart, and I love how it all works out. The pillow does need to be fluffed on occasionally, so definitely consider that. And I do think it's gonna be a best fit for average size back and stomach sleeper because it will flatten out a little bit over time. But overall, it's just a really nice down pillow with a really special surprise right in the core. So from Tempur-Pedic, they don't offer returns on their pillows and it is $149, so it's a little bit of a splurge, but I will say down lovers, I think you're gonna really love this pillow. All right, next up on my list is one of my favorite down pillows. It's from Casper. This is the Casper down pillow. They're a well-known bed in a box brand. You may have heard of them. They make several different pillows, including a really interesting and innovative down option. It starts off with this very nice 100% cotton cover, very traditional feel to it, that cool, clean, crisp cotton feel, but the inside has a five chamber design. So there's outer chambers and inner chambers, and each of those chambers has a different down to feather ratio. Now, the more down you have, the lighter, the fluffier, and probably the more expensive the pillow, the more feathers. They're two dimensional if you think about it, they're more structured and they offer more support. So the outer chambers of this particular pillow are 80% down, 20% feathers. So it's fluffier, more lightweight, from that classic down feel that you're gonna get on these outer chambers. And then the inner chambers are six 60% down, 40% feathers. So if you imagine more feathers means more support, the core is gonna be more supportive. So hands down, when you lay on this pillow, you're definitely gonna get that classic down fluffy feel, but because there's these different design chambers and they have these different ratios, it really does not fall flat on you. Over time, yes, you will need to fluff this pillow to keep it lofted, but I will say that it's a really nice, not sort of like sink your head in and fall all the way flat into it, kind of down pillow. You're getting that beautiful classic feel, but you're still maintaining a level of support. So it comes in two different sizes, standard and king. Standard is $125. Casper does give you 100 nights to try it out. And I do think it's a good fit for back sleepers on average and maybe some side sleepers because you're getting that extra level of support. Another one of my favorite down pillows is the Brooklinen down pillow in mid plush. So this is a mid plush option. It comes in plush, mid plush, and firm. And I'll let you know that because they're each very distinctive firmness levels. The mid plush, although it has the word plush in the title, which usually means soft, is actually very supportive and on the firmer side based on the other down pillows I've reviewed. It's also their best seller and the most versatile option. So I would definitely want to check that one out first. The outer cover is beautiful. It's 100% cotton, 400 thread count, has an antimicrobial treatment on the outer cover, which I think is such a nice added bonus. Now it's got two chambers inside. The outer chamber is 15% down, so down clusters are really light, fluffy, giving you that overall classic down feel when you rest your head. And the inner chamber is 85% feathers. So feathers are more two-dimensional, they stack up, they're more supportive, and that's
that's why they're built into that core, really giving you that great level of support, but you're not missing that classic down feel when you rest your head because it's all surrounding that core with those beautiful down clusters. So I love it for that reason. I love that it's very supportive. I do think it's going to be a best fit for average size side sleepers, and Martin's going to give you his take for heavier sleepers as well. It can really hold up to a lot of extra body weight, which is something that not every down pillow has and what I really like to point out. So it does come with two different sizes, standard and king, and the standard is only $69. I think that's a pretty good value and a pretty good price for the value of the pillow, so I think it's definitely worth checking out. All right, last but not least is the Pure Down Cool Down Pillow made out of natural white goose down. So I love this pillow because if you can't already tell, it's got this cool design. It's all about helping hot sleepers stay cool and being able to enjoy that beautiful, luxurious down feel. So let's just talk about this cool cover. The outer cover is 58% polyester, 42% something called olefin. It's O-L-E-F-I-N. I like to spell it out. It's a synthetic fabric known for being durable. But overall, Pure Down calls this their ice silk fabric. So it has that cool to touch feel definitely like a performance feel to it overall but I wanted to make sure you had the breakdown of exactly what fabrics are being used now you can unzip the pillow and remove the cover and care for that separately and inside you're gonna find that down fill so this pillow is actually 10% down 90% feathers when there's a lot of feathers involved it brings the price down on the pillow which is nice so this pillow is definitely very affordable it also gives it more of a structured and supportive feel and then there's down on the outside around here so you're still getting that classic down feel I will tell you it definitely feels like a down pillow it's going to flatten out a little bit more easily because there's more feathers, which again are more two-dimensional compared to that down cluster. So it's when you compress and the air leaves the pillow, it's going to get it flatter a little bit easier. But that makes it a great fit for stomach sleepers and some back sleepers because you're not getting too much loft. You're not giving an overabundance of support, but your head's also not falling straight through. So you can machine wash and dry both the outer cover and the inner cover separately or in the inner fill separately, which makes it very easy to care for. And it's quite a steal and quite a value for those of you who are looking for a cooling pillow that that's made with down. You can get two pillows, so you can get a little bundle of two for around $55 to $60 depending on the retailer, which for down is a pretty good deal overall. So I definitely like this pillow, again, for stomach sleepers, those of you who are hot sleepers, but you like the feel of down, definitely worth checking out this pure down pillow. Hey guys, Martin here to offer a different perspective. I'm a larger person than Katie. I'm also more of a side sleeper. And she made this list of the best down pillows. And in my experience, I tried all these pillows. I think three really stand out and are a good match for different types of heavier sleepers. So so let's go through those one by one. First off, we have the Tempered Down Precise Support. Now, I'm a big fan of this pillow because it has a kind of downy feel, but a tempered material in the middle, so I get a little bit of that memory foam feel. I'm a big fan of this one on my back and on my stomach. Then we have the Casper Down Pillow. Now, this was a very supportive pillow for me. Uh, it actually has a pretty, pretty good amount of loft to it, and I found this to be a really good match when I was on my side, and also a decent match when I'm on my back as well. Last but not least, we have the Brooklinen Mid Plush model. And I'm a big fan of this specifically for side sleeping because I'm a larger person. I have a bigger head. I'm a heavier person. I definitely require more support when I'm on my side. The Brooklinen is definitely giving it to me. Okay, it's time to tackle some frequently asked questions about down pillows. And the biggest one or the first one we get often is how do I choose the best down pillow or how do I choose a down pillow? So great question. I will say starting off choosing a pillow the way you would choose it with any material, which is looking at your primary sleep position. So those of you who wake up on your side, you're going to want the most support, the most firmness. You're going to go in that direction, higher, taller pillow. Back sleepers, medium amount of firmness and support and height level, and then stomach sleepers, y'all need the flattest, softest pillow. So try to go from there when you're looking at firmness and support level for your down pillow. But in terms of down, there are definitely some different varieties, some different things to look at. So you can get a pure 100% down pillow. Duck down is gonna be a smaller down cluster. Goose down is gonna be a bigger down cluster. Now down is the important part. It's insulating, it's lightweight, and it's durable. So it's definitely gonna drive the price and the value of the pillow up. So the more down there is in the pillow, probably the more expensive it's gonna be. And then you can add feathers to the pillow. So feathers, if you think about it, they're flat, they're two dimensional, they're gonna add support, they're gonna add a structure, and they're often used in the core of pillow to help it stop from going flat which you can tell is in a lot of these designs of these pillows as well so feathers adding them in and they're a cheaper product they're gonna bring the price of the pillow down a little bit and they're also gonna mean that the pillow is slightly less durable so let that be a guide in terms of how much like luxurious down you want there's also fill power and there's also ethically responsibly sourced down so there's more definitely to picking on a down pillow definitely check out the link in the description below it's my full written review I'm gonna dive into all those topics in more detail to help guide you 
The next question we get asked a lot is what's the best down pillow for side sleepers specifically? So side sleepers, y'all make up more than 50% of the American population. There are just a lot of side sleepers out there. I know I'm one of them right now. I'm pregnant and I've got to sleep on my side. So I'm all about finding the best down pillow for side sleepers as well. Totally got your back. So what y'all need is the more support and the more height on your down pillows. You do not want to sink your head into the pillow and then feel it go all the way flat. You don't want to lose a lot of air. You're going to want probably a combination of feathers and down because the feathers do provide some extra support but make sure they're probably just in that core and you're still getting that beautiful down surrounding the pillow. Um, some good options from the list that I have is the Brooklinen mid plush pillow, the down option, and then of course the Casper down pillow. Those both have some very interesting chambers that are more supportive. Petite side sleepers, I think you can also get away with that temper down precise support pillow as well. All right, the last question we get is people want to know, is duck down better than goose down or vice versa? So I will say this, it's probably going to come down to personal preference at the end of the day, but the size of the down cluster does affect the overall feel. So ducks are smaller than geese. The duck down cluster is going to be smaller than a goose down cluster. They're both going to be really soft and fluffy. They're both going to feel really gorgeous, but the bigger the cluster, the lighter weight the pillow is going to feel, the loftier it's going to be overall because it's trapping more air inside the pillow, and it's probably going to be pricier. It's also going to be more durable. So Goose Down tends to be on the more expensive side, tends to have that really ultimate classic down feel. So if you are know that you 100% want pure down, you want it to be like the most down pillow you've ever experienced, you're probably going to want to go with Goose Down. But that being said, White Down is also a very nice, soft, fluffy feel to it overall. So really, it's going to come down to personal preference. All right, there you have it. Those are my four favorite down pillows. Down has such a beautiful, classic, traditional fluffy feel to it. There's a lot of down pillows out there and I like that these each kind of bring something different to the table. Comment below on which one you think is speaking to you. I've got individual reviews plus a whole detailed list and more. Just click the link in the description below to check it out. It'll take you there and you'll get even more details on how to pick out a down pillow and which one of these might be a good fit for you. Make sure to like or subscribe to Mattress Clarity's YouTube channel for more information as well. And I hope I see you again soon. Thanks.